Hey everybody, Arthur Gaming here, and this is Bits Bins. So, I got these great little bins online, uh, at Bits Bins online, as a matter of fact, uh, and they make a good organization for your board games. Uh, the diff my problem usually is when you buy a board game insert is there's not always a lot of expansion if you need to change things, add, add expansions to the game, um, or something like that. So, it's just static. You fill some things in, you, you squeeze some things in where you can. Sometimes you buy an expansion, you got to move pieces around. Things don't get as organized as I, as I like them. I'm kind of neurotic about my board games. Uh, and, you know, I don't get to keep things organized the way I would like them. So I ran across these bits bins, uh, these nice tiny little bins. I've got other videos that you can check out on them and how many there are and all and all that kind of stuff and pricing and things. Um, and I'm just showing you today. Uh, one of my games, Orléans, or Orleans, depending on uh, if you want to say it with French flair or not, um, and how I organized it with my bit spins. So there's lots of little pieces in this game. Very good game. If you haven't played it, check it out. Um, so I organized it with, with my bit spins. Now, the hard part with this game and organizing it with the bit spins is there's lots of boards in this game. So if we unpack our bit spins real quick from the box, put them all out here, and I'll show you kind of what I did with them. If you see, if you've never played the game, the bottom like half of this box is boards. So they're player boards and uh, main board here that goes on the table and a sideboard as well. So all these boards are in here and they take up like, well, maybe not half probably about close to a third of the box. And so it makes it hard for any sort of organizational system to sit on top of them and really organize the pieces. But I think the Bitspins did a pretty good job. So I've got this nice big, what they call a card box. It's our 100 card card box, I believe it is. And there are some of these, and this was probably the hardest one to figure out. Um, these pieces that go in or Orleans are these weird, these weird square shapes. Um, I tried them at one point in one of these bins, and of course, they're not a good size. They, you know, if you look, they would take up this much of the box, and so there's all this extra space in here, so things are jiggling around. Um, I thought about maybe putting something else in with them, but nothing else really seemed to fit all that well. Um, these encounter, like, uh, timer pieces, they kind of fit in there and did, a, did an okay job, um, but then the problem was, there's a whole bunch of these, right? So if you, as you can see, I can fill a whole box with how many there are, right? So there's this whole bunch of these and one of these. So I needed like three of these to put them in, which then had me all sorts of extra space. And with three more of these, I couldn't fit it in the box. So the interesting thing with the bit spins is you have all sorts of sizes to work organizationally to try and figure out how to put them in your box. So it took me a little bit of work. Me and my wife, we sat down and we, you know, tinkered with boxes and moved pieces around and stuff. But we think we finally got um, what is the answer for or for Orleon for bit spins. So one of these hundred card boxes works works great. Holds all these tiles. Put put them in here. We did one of these bins for each player. So each player, you have your little houses, you have your player marker, and you have your little starting bag pieces in these little boxes. So there's five of these. So we got five of these guys. We stick them in here. Um, the other problem with it is, is that um, because of the size and the bit and the, the um, boards in the bottom, I can't stack these on top of each other either. Um, not they, otherwise they're sticking up and then they don't work. Two of these bigger ones. So money because there's a lot of it, and this is the pieces, the bag pieces for all the for all the um, workers. They're in one of these as well, and they fit. These do fit on top of each other perfectly. Then I got a couple of these small ones, which I do like these little small bits bins for little pieces of things. So here we got the technology markers and the little citizen markers and the starting starting player shield, and they fit nicely in these tiny little bins. So these guys go in here too. And then last but not least, we got two of these larger bins. Um, so the, the bins come in three sizes. We have a small rectangular, we have a medium rectangular, and we have a large rectangular. These are the large rectangulars I used for the last couple pieces. And these will fit right in here as well. And so you see, all fits. 
And I could probably rearrange this a little bit and did different ways if I really, really wanted to. It seems to be, there's a little bit of space in there. It's not super duper tight, but tight enough. And then on top of this goes your bags. So that will go right, go right on top, you know, and you can kind of, luckily there's some space. Like if I wanted to, I could kind of squish them in the middle a little bit um, to really get them down in there and tight. And of course that will help things from not jiggling around. And then your Orléans top goes on. And Orléans is in there. You can hear it if I shake it, but nothing's sliding around. There's none of these boxes are banging around on the inside and and getting up, getting a mess, right? That's one thing I hate when I play board games. I hate when I go to somebody else's house who doesn't organize because I'm neurotic about it, and they open up their box and just pieces everywhere in the box, and it just makes makes me crazy. So I love to have my organization done well in my board my board games, uh, and to be able to show these off. Uh, really makes me happy because I think everybody should organize their board games and they don't seem all all that expensive Especially compared to buying an organizer So so check this game out bits bins. They're the way to go bits bins online Go check them out. I'll have links down below. Please as always like share follow all that good stuff and uh, as always people stay safe